There, buddy. Big dog. Big dog's toy chest. Uh, I'm going to go over a couple things. Uh, I don't know if I showed you some things. I might have showed you another video, but I can't remember. So I, I'm going to finish some of my collection, and then I'm going to get in some new stuff that I picked up today. So uh, I collect movie cars and stuff. I don't know if I showed you these or not in another video. I might have. This is a Dukes of Hazard van. Slide this a little forward. So Dukes of Hazard public work van. This is a Rocky two car. So how's have I been doing with this COVID nineteen thing? Tell you one thing, it's got my throat cut with this uh not being able to go nowhere and buy and sell stuff, so it's Walker Texas Ranger. But uh, we're going to do what we're told to do, right? But uh, hopefully it'll get better here soon. I got uh, two of these supernatural cars. There's one, silver rims, and then I got one in the black rims. You see it or not a little glare but uh it's real cool it's 18 van Jurassic Park Jeep Dazed and Confused pick up. And I got a... This is Echo 1 and Echo 1A. Ghostbusters. And that glare is terrible. And then I got the, the newer... Echo one from the newer movie. I did on my like movie cars that are in packages. Uh, and I do got the Fast and Furious Corvette too. But, uh, I'm gonna move on to something else real quick. Here's some uh, loose movie cars. BJ and the Bear, Batmobile, that's it for that. Now I myself, I like to collect like the Matchbox Tags cars, if you guys remember the old tag cars. I got a couple of these. I got, matter of fact, I got a whole bin full of them. So. But uh, what they did is got a couple different series where they made the same car, just paint them different and put a different tag on them. But uh, um, I probably got, probably got a uh, 40, 42. I think around, I think 42 uh, of the original line cars and probably another 10 or so of uh, like the second and third edition. So, not in the best shape. I'm not going to go through all of them. But, uh, like I said, they just paint, paint them different colors. favorite Hot Wheels. I just re-got this. It's the 40's Ford. Ford oldie but a goodie. When I was with a kid, man, I remember playing with this car. This one, Cosmic Blues. They came out with many different ones, too. There was Red Flame. I think there was a 
white lightning. And then the Baja Breaker. My very first car was a Baja Breaker. I remember getting it when I was real young. My dad took me to Walmart or Kmart at the time. Might even have been Bradley's. But there's a green one. My br and my brother got this one. And what's cool about this is the Honda Racing Team. I don't know if you can see, but in the back of this is a little window. You kind of look through it. And you see the Honda race team in there, motorcycle with the mechanic working on the bike. It's kind of cool. I looked all over for this one. I couldn't find it. I just got it about a month ago, right before lockdown. Uh, now, I won't get into too much stuff, but uh, I, said, I do movie cars. It's generally Ertl brand, the one the actual figures sit in. It's a really good shape. So, really good, good shape. I also have a remote control one. I might have a remote for this. I think it's a 27 frequency. And uh, if so, I'm gonna, I can, might be able to make it move, but it does turn on. They just don't have the controller to, to make it work. Then I have the 124 scale Ertl. I have a couple more general leads. I have a lot of Matchbox cars. I just they're in another box put away. I got to get them. Uh, growing up, like I said, I was a big fan of Bigfoot. Uh, I found this for a quarter at a yard sale. It's an old Bigfoot. It's all broken. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make like a cover on it and make it look like a sunroof and just paint it up blue like the Bigfoot and just have it so I can sit on my shelf. Uh, after Bigfoot came out, there's many other kind of trucks that came out. There was a the animal trucks with the claw. You turn the wheel. Somewhere there. It turns. That one locked up. But anyhow, these claws are supposed to come out. They all seem to be locked up. But these claws come out, but it's missing the battery front plate, so I don't even know if it works. But that was another quarter pickup. Uh, after the Bigfoot Play School came out, then they started to do many different trucks, like this is Stomper. Uh, this was neat. This one does work. And then uh, after Stomper, they came out with Stomper Bully, which was a little bigger. You can actually take this one and float this in the water because of the flotation tires. So uh, this one works as well. So that's like I said, that's some of my collection stuff. And I, I collect monster trucks. Uh, anything Bigfoot related. This is I picked this another like 50 cent pick. Uh, this one doesn't work. They got the wires cut on this side. So I don't know if you see the wire right there. But uh, just I'm gonna try to do my best to clean it up so it sit on the shelf. My kid was little, took him down to Wildwood Beach. Barefoot was down there, I got, he signed it. So it's kind of cool. That one was down there. This Bigfoot was down there. This was the new Miss, the bigger Miss Bigfoot. Now this isn't Orange Blossom Special. But it looks like the pool truck aren't lost some special on it at the wheel stands. So I saw it, I had to pick it up. We got a broken headlight, but it's still okay. There's a lot of push trucks, hot wheels, bounty hunter, Donkey Kong.
Sox. I like Stompers, and I was a big fan of the Stompers in the 80s. I had a big collection of them, but of course, you know, if you're a kid, you break 95% of them. So anything that's battery powered, it reminds me of Stomper. I like to pick them up. So um, I got these. This is from this, uh, this hauler set up here called the Semi Hauler. Has four cars with it. And it's a track trailer. The track trailer works. All the cars, all these work. Got two Chevelles, a Chevy Avalanche, GTO, Dodge Viper, and a 57 Chevy. Uh, then I have some Stomper stuff. This works, but it's missing the, the cover and the hookup plate for the trailer. But uh, that works. Just a cool little sand buggy I picked up. This is one of those uh, from the Dukes of Hazard, one of the play sets. It's missing the back rubber tires. It's one of the ones you wind up and it goes. These are some, uh, these are Rough Riders. These are knockoff stompers, but they, uh, they were cool. They had these little hubcaps that kind of like here. You actually lean them up on their side and they ride like two wheels. So that's cool. There's Stomper. Some of these work, some don't. Got that one. Got a couple of them Night Rider, Roof Riders. Another Roof Rider. And so most of these work, some don't. But, uh, just some couple different bottoms. So that's it for them. Now let's get into what I picked up today so far. I'm waiting for another guy to hit me back. I might have to pick up something else, but there's a right now. I went to my buddies today and got a couple cool things. So I just want to share it with you. I picked this up today from a gentleman that had it on the marketplace. This is a beast swarm. Uh, East Wars Transformer. What's his name? Torka. So, it's got his gun, everything's there. It, when he's not using his gun, he's in form. Basically, very easy to transform. Bring his jaw around. There he is, he's like a walking fish. And he just spins his legs back around, drop his jaw, pull his fin off, put it back in there, done. When they got more modern, they got really easy to transform. So, I picked that up today. I've been coming across a lot of street sharks. Also, been coming across uh, um, or the dinosaur ones too. So, so these guys are kind of cool. Slopster, I think his name is. I got slopster on wheels. These guys are pretty good. They're probably about forty dollars, thirty-five, forty bucks. The other ones are running around. It depends on condition, but they can go from twenty up to like thirty bucks. So, so here's some of the dinosaurs that I got. 
I already have one. Kind of these Tyrannodon looking things. But it seems like I got a few more of them now. Try to see if I can block that light. There you go. Like a Triceratops. There's another Tyrannodon. Actually, look through it. The light's terrible. So we can move this a little bit further. There we go. You can shine that light a little bit. T-Rex. These are all pretty clean. This one's a little on the dirty side, but he's not really too bad. These are Power Rangers. Parmadilla. Really, really good. Shoot. Here's our Erdo 18 van. Missing the stickers. Kind of a little beat up a little bit. Like the side was like blowed out, but uh, the door opens. It's missing the front seat. It's got one seat in here, but I'm going to move the back seat to the front seat. I have four the four figures that go with this too, so I have an extra Hannibal. These aren't perfect, so I picked them up for a buck a piece. I've been chewed on a little bit, fingers missing, but still cool. If you don't have any collection, at least you can say you have them. They not, might not be perfect, but Dicky Dragon. I don't know who that is. Thank you.